giving your contacts an opportunity to connect with you in ways they may not have known were possible is what sharing your social links in your emails can do. As one of the sites you are linking to may be your customer's preferred way of getting new information from your business. We recommend using the social link widget to add your social links to your campaigns and automation emails. Unless the specific goal of your email is to drive people to your social networks, these buttons usually serve as a secondary action where you can redirect subscribers to your social media profiles or let subscribers share your communication on their social networks. Let's see this together in the platform. To add the social links content block to our email, let's open a campaign up and from the blocks section, let's drag and drop the social links block into our email. Once added, the social link builder model will appear. Here we can choose to have the links open to our own social network pages, or we can choose to let subscribers share our communication in their own social networks. To redirect subscribers to our own social media networks, we enter our social media URLs into the appropriate fields. If there is a network listed that we do not want to use, we can toggle it into off. We can also reorder the social networks in this block by clicking this icon and moving it to our desired spot. In the Customize tab, we can customize how the social icons appear in our email by adjusting the button style and theme. Under button style, we can choose to have the icons appear as flat or 3D from the first dropdown. If we choose the flat option, we can have the icons appear as solid or show an outline of the button instead. We can also choose to have the buttons appear as colorful, dark or light. With the 3D option, we can choose to have the icons appear as colorful, dark or light. We can also customize the themes, choosing from square, round or hexagon. The check mark will indicate the shape we selected. And at the top here, we can see a preview of them. Once we have that ready, we click save and our customized social icons will then be added to our email. If we need to go back and make any changes before sending our campaign out, we can do so by clicking the block again and then clicking the first option. We can also display the icons as vertical or horizontal in here or have the icons appear to the left, right or center of the content block. I hope you found that helpful. If so, let us know by liking this video and I would also like to invite you to subscribe to our channel and turn the notifications on so you don't miss out on any new videos. Thank you for watching.